to my unshaven face. Uh, I apologize about the unshavenness. I've been lazy. Incredibly, incredibly lazy. I am cooking, therefore I am waiting for things to be done. So I decided to vlog a little bit because I have my phone back and it's a lovely day and I haven't done it in a while. Now... Hoping you guys can actually hear me. But... but, 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 but. There are a few things happening. Um, one of them is that the videos are back, the Let's Plays are back of EU4, which is fantastic because I haven't done them in a while. It's been about two weeks, three weeks since I recorded last. Um, and I was very happy that I got into the groove of things quickly again and editing and everything. Um, there are still weird cuts in the videos, I don't really know why there are weird cuts in the videos. I've been trying to rectify that problem, but I can't seem to find what the issue is. I don't know why. I can see myself in the back of the phone. Um, what else? I'm doing a new series, most likely. Um, I mentioned this before, and I still want to do it, which is a series on the Great Women of History. I don't know if I mentioned that, but I said I was playing another series. It's on the Great Women of History. It would be like a five-minute-long segment of, you know, like Catherine the Great or Maria Theresa and Mother Teresa and who else? Florence Nightingale and Ada Lovelace. Uh, well, so the, the both of the Elizabeths, Queen Mary of Scots, the, the Duchess of Aquitaine, I think she was, as well, and people like that. So there's, there's a bunch of women in history that are really, that are really significant to history, but they're usually not mentioned, or are mentioned kind of in passing, like, yeah, she was married to this and this dude, or, you know, that they, 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 you don't talk about them that much, because the history of the world is the history of man, and all that jazz. Um, which is great and all, but it doesn't really work that way. So, I want to do a five minute series, you know, an episode a week, maybe an episode every two weeks of five minutes of talking about a great woman of history um, and just, you know, kind of letting you guys know what the story behind the woman is. And that's why I want to do it five minutes because five minutes I think is kind of the optimal time and everything above five minutes is a bit long and can get a bit tedious. Um, although, not always, Crash Course does this really well. Um, if you have, don't follow Crash Course, Crash Course does an amazing series currently on World History Season 2 and they're doing, I think it's psychology? But I'm not, don't watch that one because psychology isn't something that I'm interested in and I was not in high school, not now. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? Republica came out. It changed a few things. I think it's actually a bit better than it used to be, although the aggressive expansion is a bit weird still. Um, it's a bit high, which I don't like, but we'll live, I guess. Um, I'm currently playing a, kind of an Iron Man game on my own of um, France. Just because I wanted to, to get a simple Iron Man game. I've been playing these kind of series with Republica and they're really fun. Um, I want to start a, another kind of an Iron Man game on my own, maybe as the Hansa, um, or Venice, probably the Hansa, or maybe Novgorod. The, the, Novgorod's a Merchant Republic. Um, kind of as a, either a Merchant Republic or some sort of a Republic because the Republica did things for these nations, um, especially for Merchant Republics. So I kind of want to play as a Merchant Republic. Um, preferably, but maybe Novgorod. I quite like the idea of playing as Novgorod. Um, what else? Anything else? I just feel like talking and I don't have anything to talk about. But yeah, um, I, I know what I, I can apologize for not having, you guys not having videos for a, for a week or maybe two weeks. A week, I think, of no videos, so there were four videos missing. Um, because of the new schedule, which I really like, which is four videos a week, it gives me plenty of time to do other things. Um, and I, I'm sorry there weren't the videos, it's just I didn't have time to pre record enough and upload enough, and um, I, just the internet, actually I, I pre recorded enough, I couldn't upload them, because my internet connection here where I live is quite shit, and where I went to vacation it was even shitter, because I went on vacation for two weeks, um, uh, which was so good. Um, I vacationed on the, uh, in Croatia, on Kirk, which is an island, 
just lovely. I mean, we didn't have the best weather, but I, it just kind of the change of atmosphere and the change of people and just being in a different place kind of revitalizes my batteries so I can do more things again. Although I get annoyed when I have a bunch of things when I, that I have to do when I get home, but it was fun. And so I didn't have time, I didn't, couldn't upload enough videos for there to be videos continuously while I was away. So I do apologize about that. I'll, I'll try to get more of them up next time. Someone's looking in through my window. Um, I'll get more up next time so that you guys have more videos. And I'm hoping that in the next few months I can upgrade my internet connection to a different provider who would they be able to provide me with a faster connection. Um, for some reason, my provider can't. And yeah, but I'm still under contract for a bit. Yeah, st and yeah, there's just a bunch of upgrades that I need to do. I, I extended my contract with my job, which means that I should be able to get a bit more money in. Um, but I really do need to buy a new graphics card because this one just isn't cutting it anymore. It's just not working as it should. Um, it's working even worse lately. So I'm hoping to get that new in, and the one I want isn't actually that expensive, but when you have costs of, you know, everyday bills and, you know, I, we had to replace this big panoramic window which is behind me, this one had to be replaced because it broke, um, and it's just all the costs come up and so I can't upgrade things, and that's why I also can't just play any new game I want. It, it's kind of a thing in life, and it, it, life would be less interesting if we didn't have to worry about some things, I think. Um, but yeah, I guess it's just me. I like having something to go toward, something to strive to do, something to, you know, to have in the short term and then in the long term plan of having to do something, because otherwise I'm just bored out of my brains. Like my short term, my short term plan, um, for this year was that A, I finish my um, a, uh, GCSEs and A-levels, basically, um, which is like the final exams in high school, and, um, because I dropped out of high school. Um, and to finish that and get that going and, you know, to have an education, and now I do. Um, I just finished it, I just got the results, I now have a high school education and I have a stable job. and. Just these short term long term plans that I've achieved that I strive towards because otherwise I am lost. Um, and yeah, I like having goals mostly because I also suffer from anxiety and panic attacks, which means that I find it hard to do a lot of things. Um, I find it hard to go places because I have the expectation that I'm going to have a panic attack, and I usually do. And it usually some of them are, can be quite bad and they deter you from doing things, and then for that day and the next day you're so washed out and so dead you don't feel like doing anything all you feel like doing is dying and st or and or sleeping um so having short-term plans and long-term plans for me is really good um it kind of helps me to look forward to things and to do exciting things it also helps because i really want to do them so it kind of counters for panic attacks and it's just life and on that s sad note i think life Potatoes for mashed potatoes are done, which means I need to go do the sauce, which today is a very weird specialty. Um, some of you might like it, some of you might not. I'm doing a, we're having mashed potatoes and then a green salad, and we're having a sauce that is made out of um, cow heart. This cow's heart, it's the thing. I actually prefer liver, but um, cow's heart will do. It's gonna be, still gonna be lovely, I think. I'm just gonna. It's quite simple. I'm gonna do this the simple way because I'm just a little bit lazy. I'm gonna um, put some onions and oils, let them brown for a bit, and then I'm gonna throw in the um, very thinly sliced um, cow heart. Um, salt, salt it a little bit, add a little bit of spices, then just put a little bit of water in there, um, let it kind of steam in itself so that they kind of become soft and mushy. Um, well, not mushy, just kind of they soften up and then they cook. I'm gonna put a little bit more water, uh, maybe kind of make um, make it a little bit denser with a little bit of flour, and that's gonna be it. Mashed potatoes and give me salad, and it's just gonna be lovely. I think it's gonna be lovely. But yeah, I have to go do that, and I hope you guys enjoyed this. It was a very weird vlog, and I feel like I've been talking for at least twenty minutes. Probably haven't, uh, but I hope you guys kind of enjoyed these vlogs. And um, before I actually go. 
the 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 greatest moment of history series, the five minute series. I really like the idea, and I'm slowly getting through and writing a script and you know making that. But I'm not really sure how to do it. So if kind of leave your suggestions on what you would prefer to see or what you think would be better if it would be better that I do a video in the style of maybe CGP Grey where he has kind of a sort of animated video with just a voiceover or in the style of Crash Course which is a camera in front of my face where I talk and you know with things popping up and pictures and woo thingies um, or more of a you know more of a I don't know these are the only thing I think of, but yeah, kind of leave your suggestions below because I want your input and I'm going to get input from a couple of my friends and then I'm going to see how I want to do it because I think this would... It's something that I'm looking forward to do, I've been looking forward to do it for a while, but I haven't been able to, but yeah. Leave your suggestions in the comments below, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and until next time, bye-bye.